Hey guys, Bart Simpson 67543 here, and what you're looking at is my car. Uh, this is a 1997 Chevy Lumina. Uh, it is very dirty right now because I live in the country, and we have a lot of... Um, I live in a town that's in the country, and we have a lot of gravel roads out here. Um, but it is a beautiful day. As you can see, all the snow is melting. Uh, the high today was about 58 degrees. Right now it's about 50, it's still about 58 degrees. It's in the upper 50s. I'm out here in a t-shirt. So that's pretty cool. But that's not the point of this video. Nope. I'm going to be showing you my car today. I know I promised to make this video a long time ago. And uh, I'm going to start it up for you. And we're just going to have a general look-see. Well, first, how about I unlock my car? I don't have a key fob or anything like that. So, I have to unlock the key. Open up the door, like so, sit on down, and this is the inside. You can see the dashboard. I have a CB radio hooked up here, and I have a new radio that's hooked up here that you'll see in a moment. This, uh, this radio here is not factory, obviously. So we'll turn this car on, and you can see this radio here with the 3.5 millimeter and its USB. Um, this is a 3.1 millimeter, or 3.1 millimeter, 3.1 liter engine, and uh, I'll pop the hood for you. And uh, very nice car overall. I got it for $950, and uh, it's a pretty nice car. Uh, top speed in this thing is about 115. So we'll get out here. And I'll show you a couple things I had done to it. Um, one, you can see this exhaust down here. This I had to put on, or have put on, because when I bought the car, it did not have an exhaust at all. And this right here is the only major rust on this car. I know it looks terrible because of the gravel dust, but... And this is a 97. Um, you can't probably can't read that because the camera sucks, but... It was built in Oshawa, Ontario in March of 97. But anyway, so I'll have the hood open here. So we'll get this opened up for y'all. If I can find the little... If I can find the little stupid hook. Uh, here it is. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to put the camera down in a second. All right, folks, so this is what I'm working with here. And you can see all the belts and everything are working as they should be. So we're gonna close that on up. And so that is what's under the hood of a 3.1 liter Chevy Lumina. And you can see my CB radio antenna here. Go back in and sit down. And this car does have a high mileage on it. I uh, don't know if you can read that at all, but it has 243,862 miles on it. Um, I bought it with about 241,000. So, uh, yeah. So it's running pretty good. I'd, the thermostat and the radiator is a little high because I just uh, drove back from Decorah, which is about 20 miles away. And everything works. Uh, Coolant works. Uh, this car does have kind of a neat feature. Well, most cars have a rear defroster, but you push the button in, and when that orange indicator lights on, that means it is on. So, yeah. 
So the car is in pretty good shape um, overall. No big uh, damage to any interior or anything, except there is a hole right, right here. And uh, these things broke off from where the visors connect up here. But other than that, it's a pretty nice car. So I'm just gonna shut it off. Stuff outside here. There is a big dent right here. I bought the car like this. I don't know what hit it. Maybe a deer or something. But, uh, yep. So this is the car here, and then this is my mom's 97 Buick LeSabre. You can see our driveway's a mud pit right now. So, yeah, that's about it. Um, please subscribe.